Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm your host, Corey Knockreiner. Today's story is an update on fraudulent TurboTax filings. You probably remember a few weeks back when I mentioned that customers were seeing an increase in false or fraudulent tax filings that seemed to come from TurboTax. Essentially, bad guys either hijacked your TurboTax account or filed one for you and would then file your taxes and thus get your return. For a time period, TurboTax actually turned off state filings to figure out what was going on. Well, just this week, Krebs on Security posted a scoop where two ex-Intuit employees have said that uh, TurboTax is not doing as much as it can to protect you against this fraud. Essentially, they said there's many techniques TurboTax can use to identify this fraud, but doing so could affect their bottom line. They make money for tax filings, whether it's a criminal or you doing the filing. And they suggest that if they, they did more to stop this fraud, the fraud will just go to some other tax filing company out there. Now these are just allegations and in a blog post Intuit basically says this is malarkey. They do as much as they can to protect customers. They're the number one reporter of tax fraud to the IRS and other things like that. So I just thought this was an interesting story. But whether you believe the whistleblowers are into it, one thing remains true. That is bad guys are targeting online tax filing systems. So if you're in the US and you're filing your taxes, some simple tips are first, use a very, very strong password. It should be 14 characters or, or higher. It should be random and not something you use anywhere else. More importantly, as I mentioned before, try to file your taxes as quick as you can. It really is a simple tip, but if you file for your social security number, uh, an attacker can't file for you. So if you file early, you may protect yourself. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.